And welcome back to The Long Run, where we are playing Lufia and the Fortress of Doom. Uh, restored? Yes, restored. Uh, let's not talk about the chair jewel. So the last time we managed to save a half-elf girl who ended up guiding us through this forest and also joining our party. So now we have our full party. And we can face these killer bees. Not the bees. Right. Poison pin and Jaren waste no time in leveling up. Talk to that old man. Hydration achieved, and I guess I got a stretch too, huh? But yes, this chair is, I feel like it is getting freakier as we speak, and there's probably something that I could do to maintain it, but I don't know what it is. It's enough that I actually put this chair together and I don't have any WD-40 and that's not really something that I would go out of my way to buy right now. Typically, it's more important to buy things like food. I didn't get a new fridge, Jewel. And even if I needed a new fridge, I wouldn't be paying for it out of pocket. I live in an apartment. It's covered by the apartment. There's a town there. Let's go. Uh, let's go take a look at what's uh, what's in there. You have a single attack. I don't think you do. I probably do need to uh, to get myself healed though. I'm down to 48 health. Ah. Press the correct buttons. There we go.
Yeah, that's uh, that's a good feature. Also, where are we? I was looking at chat when the, uh, the town name came up. Ooh, wow. North of town has turned into a toxic marsh. Oh. Also, yeah, there was... There was indeed an inn right here, so... Using a spell to restore health was the correct course of action, because that means we didn't spend items doing that. An empty bottle and a life, uh, life source. What can we do with an empty bottle, I wonder? So let's see if there's anything else around here. Just for good measure. Yep. Dang. Someone robbed your chest already. Gem shop. No one wants to fight the dark ghost, you say? No one except for me. I ain't afraid of no ghost. Who can wear... Oh, that is a big downgrade. Why would you use that? I just stole this, this old lady's cleaver for no reason. It's not like we can get it back. Let's see if there is anything in this marsh. There probably isn't because this is the other world. But I'm gonna check anyway. Marshing around. Jerry Moore's up again. Um, detox you. I'm about to level up. Probably shouldn't use a whole lot of magic on... Oh, please. Yes, they're your attacks. Please do not all fight Jaren. He doesn't have that much HP, guys. Oh! Her regular attack hits everyone. I didn't account for that. Okay, that uh, that changes things.
here we are in Genova. Choose a good weapon here at the armor shop. Here, but also, your weapon hits everything, and I think I want to keep you on that. Give them the good, the good vibes and nuggies. But yeah, overall, this seems to be pretty much the same uh, items and weapons and stuff as the previous shop. Tower on the eastern island, and green tower on the southern island. Okay. We're closed. That's too bad. I'm going in anyway. Yes, actually. Sure, I'll buy your drink. What do you know about El Freight? Hey, hurry, eh? You young folks can't rush me. How about buy me another drink? You're getting brighter all the time. I like that. People should be generous. All right, now let's have it. Mm -hmm. To reach Alfrey, you must. You have to collect the three gems: blue, green, and red. Three gems. There are three islands here. Each one has a tower. The towers hold the gems. Find them, and the way to Alfrey will open. If you want to find Alfrey, you must get your hands on these three gems. You can tell she's drunk, cause she's saying the same thing five times. There's an inn on the first tower, uh, first floor of the green tower south of town. No villages are near the green tower. You can use the inn once you arrive there. Oh, neat. The fabled RGB gems. See, sometimes, even when they tell you the place is closed, you just gotta go in anyway and screw the consequences. We have a half elf. Will the way to Elfrey a half open? Yeah, a really nice lake that's not really so nice anymore. Okay, so we need to we need to find the gems which are in the towers. It's Big Mouth and Jerem is friggin' paralyzed. The one party member who can attack all of the enemies for free gets paralyzed. Let's get started with this blue tower. Alright, we found the blue rings. Surely that's what we're looking for, right? We can go home now. This is attack and defense. Hmm. 
can give you a fly ring, I think. It's blue da wo di da wo da wo di da wo di da wo da Pierre, oh la la. Why did I cast Droplet on the frogs? It seems like a bad idea. I'm entirely aware of the fact that I'm old. So that way is probably an exit of some kind. Oh, we got a magic guard. Speaking of... Uh, yeah, there are some sources here that uh, we could probably use. By sources, plural, I mean source singular. Probably have to drop in from uh, from the top to get that. Like here, for instance. We got a revive. We got a green jade. Oh, it was. Oh, interesting. So it's not just the matter of finding the uh, the gems in the towers, but we found the green jade in the blue tower. So possibly we need to use. Is that in writing? Let's go to the red tower last. Good to know. Lufia wastes her attack. My potion. Surprise attack. And I'm not strong, I'm not flash on this guy. See if we can get rid of this guy quickly. Not quickly enough that Lufia doesn't uh, attack a fellow party member.
Doesn't do a whole lot of uh, damage to these guys, though. Which is unfortunate. Never does drop it for that matter. Okay, y'all can spread out your attacks a little more and quit attacking the uh, the tiniest member of our party who just leveled up. She grew one centimeter taller. Um, Double kill. Sweet. Dark elves. They're elves, but more. Well, they're not very dark, honestly. I mean, look at them. They're clad in, in white garb. They're blonde. What's what's so dark about them? This isn't Dark Souls. This is Lufia. Okay, you can stop it with the strong. Only I may heal. I think I might, I might as well have just uh, done a regular attack before that amount of damage. Lufia, are we looking for one piece? We found several pieces. Alright, I need to do that. Cool. Look, pedestal. Good talk. Anyway, this is the blue tower. We don't have the blue gem, so we're going to get ambushed just before we jump off of this tower. Pedestal seed. I mean, in that we... 
we have to put a seed of some kind on the pedestal, namely the gem that we would get from some other tower. I guess you could call it a seed. Okay, so we got the green jade. The, the green tower is at the south. I'm gonna go to town first so that we can heal up. Where is the end? That is not the end. There it is. G is a hundred? Does Salmonella approve of me? Oh! I was wondering who you're talking about there, Salmonella. I was like, we were just talking about it being a pedestal seed, which is a link to the past reference. I'm, I'm good at brain the making smart. Some of those were words. I mean, arguably they're all words, it's just the order might be a little questionable. Okay, so we already know we need to go to the Red Tower last. COVID after coughs. Yeah, I remember, um, and I don't, I don't know if this would apply to you. But I remember at one point just getting like a regular cough and it didn't really go away. And my doctor basically gave me um, an inhaler and uh, that cleared it up with like no problem. There was just some like fluid left in the lungs or something. Yeah, it really sucked too because like uh, I ended up doing some streaming to like substitute for a friend of mine who had uh, gone on vacation and also kept substituting for like an extra week or two after that because um, she had broken her leg on vacation and the entire time like I wanted to do my voice acting thing, but um, I had uh, I had some pretty bad um, remnant coughs. So I had to mostly just play quietly, which kind of sucked. <laughs> Strange, but the guests always come, so I do well here. It's 150 gold. Okay, fine. It's a real convenience pricing here. We have a magic guard. This seems important. Let's uh, take a screenshot of that. Okay. 
work. As long as it's not an OS slash 2 work. Yeah, I've seen a couple of videos about that operating system. It's like, it really tried. It tried so hard, and it didn't get anywhere useful. And it's kind of sad. But I will always remember the commercial of the two nuns who for some unknown reason were talking about OS slash 2 war. And maybe that was the most successful thing about that operating system was the weird marketing they had. <laughs> Okay, well, um, you requested hydrate. I have no water left, so I gotta be right back. Okay, hydration achieved as well as stretching and all of that. Where were we again? Oh right, in the middle of a fight. Well, technically not in the middle. We were at the start of the fight. <laughs> Oh, I am definitely not an active kitty. If I was an active kitty, maybe I'd be doing rain fit more often than, you know, zero times a century. Okay, well, I've done it more than zero times a century, but... I definitely haven't done it this year. Which isn't saying much, I realize. Hopefully we can get to Agro before, uh... Okay, we finished the, the battle first anyway, so... So one thing that I notice is that these are downward staircases. What if we stand... Oh, come on! Let me finish my thought before you attack me. Yeah, it didn't take long for Jaren to uh, to get get to our level. Get on my level. 
And she's like, wall okay, me. Oh. Okay, thank goodness. I did it cast it twice, but it was a single cast. Like a single target per cast. Anyway, my thought didn't uh, didn't pan out here. I thought if I stood like in the hole there, it would uh, take me up, but I guess not. go up and... Okay, fine. That one is engraved on a stone clock somewhere, but it's written in life. Okay. boy. Fortunately, we managed to clear that fight just fine. Yes, a pedestal. Good observation. Not sure how we get to that. I should, I should probably interject with that attack. Here, here, here. Oh, come on. Let me think. Definitely gonna need some big heals after this. 
by which I mean it might be time to finally get to them. And use these liquors that uh, I have been hoarding for no real reason. I can see why this was changed to like cider in the uh, North American localization. This ain't gonna work, but let's let's see what uh, let's confirm that it doesn't work. Yeah, I'm not really sure. Confuse. Oh dear, we're ambushed and immediately Lufia gets confused. Can I have you? No, you would attack the entire party, that's no good. And both of you would just completely destroy her. Like, Luffy is the, the party member that I use to whack other party members to unconfuse them. But if Luffy is the one who's confused, then, uh... Also, I didn't want to have everyone attack Lamia. I kind of slipped on the controls there. So what I'm going to try to do... Look, a pedestal. Yes. What if we use the green jade? It will not let us use the green jade. Yes, there is a pedestal. Good observation. What do we do with it? Whatever, I'm gonna go to the Red Tower. The new girl isn't ahead of Lufia, she is... she is ahead of Argyle. Oh, she was? Yeah, this, uh, this game has a thing where you pick a group of enemies to attack, and it doesn't retarget, so if you um, pick a group and there's no one left in that group, then you've effectively attacked nothing. and learn stronger. A high potion and a red ring. As long as it's not a red ring of doom. Oh geez, speaking of doom. Wow.
Also, I like how these guys are called Shaggy. And considering that they know Bang, they call him Mr. Bombastic. They're fantastic. Yes, I am a nerd. I'm glad you noticed. And, and also, since I since I did just run Mr. Bombastic, because I'm in Halifax, we have to do the whole moment of silence thing. Anyway. No one's gonna catch that reference, but if they do, they are well versed in the ways of the internet. Got an ear pick. The hell's an ear pick? Used to clean ears, but can damage enemies. Can be thrown at foes, but why buy this? Now the, the whole point, Jewel, was that I didn't say anything. sources. I think my inventory is full at this point. Um, yeah, you have the least health, so I'll give that to you. And then we gotta cast flow again, and I'm also going to use, if I can menu my way over there. Holy crap. Can I use a sweet water? And immediately get attacked anyway. What the fuck? Yikes. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Oh. This is bad. Uh Yeah, just keep yourself alive. Or try to anyway. Oh great, now Luffy is confused. Uh, Gale. Can we pull this out? The answer is probably no. Holy crap! One health left. One point of health left. But then she she's put to sleep and it doesn't matter anyway. Right? 
Uh, it was really looking like I was able to save that, but I guess not. Ah. Way to give me hope for, for nothing there, game. Because I think the, uh, the inn there is only Tenji. Yeah. I imagine probably someone was worried when I, uh, when I left town without healing up first, but, uh, I knew what I was doing. gonna be the same door. Yeah, float. Now I'll just attack. Oh, I definitely am a doofus. But there's no mistaking that. Blue is blue, green is green, red is last. Thanks. If blue or red would be in big trouble. What does that mean? I don't understand. Like, that did not elucidate any more than what we already knew, that red was the last. Also, the sweet water was still running, apparently. I can do bang too. Okay. More reasons why I don't like Windows. It just finds new and exciting things to notify me about. The hell is that? Maybe I want to not deal with that right now. Well, mainly it's, uh, it was giving me a notification about turning off notifications for a program that, uh, doesn't really notify me all that much. It's like, if I want to turn off notifications for a program, I will tell you.
uh, more of these jerks. These pugs. That looks nothing like a pug. For starters, it's not even a dog. It's some sort of avian. Look at the claws. Not a pugilist either. by more extremely dangerous things. Yeah, I can't use escape here. That's, that's for leaving the dungeon. That's not for uh, escaping from combat. The only way to escape from combat is using that option. I'm also glad they removed random encounters. Maybe it's been a while, but how do you f how do you fight in uh, the second Mafia game then? Oh jeez. No, but if there are no random encounters, how do you get into fights? That's my question. seen on this floor. Have I been up here? Yeah, I have. Okay. Just kind of doing it the lazy way at this point. A bunny suit? Oh my! That is definitely not an upgrade. Suits mature women. I have questions.
you're a mature woman, you can have the bunny suit. J just as a note though, it may not have very high defense. I imagine there's probably a reason why you would want to equip that, I just can't really fathom what the point is. Okay, now I already attacked Agro, you don't need to also attack him guys. And that's basically what I figured, Joel, but like... In most cases, it can't really be that useful. I've already been here. I think I've already been pretty much everywhere that I can be in this tower, except for uh, whatever's at the top. Oh, except for the bottom. I, w I was in the middle of checking the bottom and seeing if there was a... If there was maybe something hidden in the muck. But then I got destroyed and didn't finish that search. I'm not making that joke, Jewel. There is such a thing as overplaying a joke. Ah, dang it. I didn't want to cast that on myself. I want to cast that on Nagaro. Okay, let's try this again. And hopefully not get immediately destroyed by something. doing this for no reason. I'm not too worried about using my sweet waters because you can just buy those. It's the foul waters that you can't just buy. Also, I'm not doing this very efficiently because, like, I keep overshooting, but I don't think that there is anything down here. I'm pretty sure I've scanned, at the very least, almost everything down here. So there was nothing down there. Which leads me again to like, what am I supposed to be doing? Oh goody, immediately just get ambushed with fireball.
took care of the big problem. Try and interact with the monster at the top of the red tower. And because I'm doing that, I'm going to save. says no. I say otherwise. We're gonna do like they do on the game show and charge. And yes, there is actually a game show called Whew. It's spelled W-H-E-W exclamation mark. And there are some episodes on uh, on YouTube and it's a pretty neat show. Like it's kind of wacky. It is kind of sad that it didn't last very long. So sad Fox's dad died of Pigma. What's Pigma? Pigma knows! <laughs> I still vaguely recall we learned Koma. <laughs> That's really funny to me and probably no one else in the world. But uh, I vaguely recall when the whole Ligma thing was new. And like, there was some confusion over what the hell it was, like some legitimate confusion. And I think there was actually, like, an actual news story that said that, uh, some content creator was dying of Ligma. <laughs> The unfortunate thing, I think it was PewDiePie and well, he's still alive. My understanding is that he is not he now has a child and hopefully has calmed the fuck down. Another bunny suit, yay.
Oh, who are you? This tower is mine. Did that dratted water, water fairy send you? I hate intruders. Okay, um... This has been a very bad decision. I don't think I have any, like, heal everyone right now. Because the, the X potion is just restores a lot of HP. Well, I think we're dead. Aluffy is still alive, but um, not for long. So that was a bad decision. That was a very bad decision. Let's pretend that never happened. I mean, P Pigma knows, that seems, uh, seems like a pretty good one, honestly. Because typically you, you don't pick the, the other thing that I will attempt to avoid to say. But you would pick your nose. Well, some people would pick their nose. I don't know if you do. And I'm not going to judge if you do. So I don't really know what it is that I'm supposed to be doing. I think that's pretty clear. All we know is blue is blue, green is green, and red is last. And that's not particularly useful information. We have the green jade, we've been to the top of green tower, and, you know, we get to the pedestal, it says, look, a pedestal. Cool, are we gonna do something with it? No. Is Gamba still there? Because I know that, I know that Gamba had a, um, a guide open. As far as I can tell, he's not there. And also, with J-Pop not here, I guess it it's, comes down to me. Uh, Okay, to open the way to Alfreya, you'll need to place three gems on the corresponding towers. You'll find one gem in each of the towers. A blue tower holds the green gem, the green tower holds the red gem, the red tower holds the blue gem. Found after defeating the ghost in the basement. Ghost in the basement? The ghost's not in the basement. Maybe that's the problem. 
Let's first defeat the ghost at the top of the tower. Give me a minute, Jewel. I'm trying to figure out what the hell I'm supposed to do. I guess let's review our equipment. And so I have a bunch of bronze helms, like shoes. I guess you're the one who should have the blue ring, and you should have the flash ring. anything called the flash ring. It could be that the name was changed with the patch. Days ring. Don't have that either. Flame ring. I have the fire ring. To this guy, you should have the blue ring. You can also have the tan shoes, which I, I assume you mean the hide boots. And uh, Agra should have the spike shoes. He should also have a long sword, but we can't buy a long sword. Light armor. He should have a buckler. He doesn't right now. Ron's helmet. He has one. And the day's ring. I don't know what the day's ring is. Green ring increases all stats. Maybe I'll give you the green ring. What else should you be wearing? You should be wearing a uh, high boots, I guess. Alright. <laughs> Sonic ring.
I think the rest of this equipment is pretty much correct. Cyanic. Okay. Anyway, let's go ahead and get untangled, then stretch. Time to dang a lang this ding dong. Uh, as far as I can tell, I need to go to the green tower. And get accosted by spell snails? Okay. speed to the snails. walk up through the door to a hallway. And go to the left. And there's a friggin' switch here. Uh, wait, it was already up, wasn't it? Put the switch down. But it still looks like it's up. So that's what I missed this entire time. Yeah, there we go. There's staircase there's a staircase here now. There wasn't one before. It's not so much BS, it's like, for all the exploration that I was doing, I didn't do the one bit of exploration that I was meant to do. The red sapphire, but it's broken. It's in pieces, there's, there's no use in taking this. Also, did that say red sapphire? Sapphires aren't red. Sapphires are blue. Okay, let's see. Gotta switch the switch back up. Oh boy, our heavy hitter is confused. Let's use a light hitter to hopefully unconfuse.
And now Lufia knows how to coma. Make monsters sleepy. It's weird that hitting a monster or like hitting someone who is asleep getting hit. Is that what I'm trying to say? Um, they just kind of don't wake up. And Jaren levels up. And then you tell us a secret. Examine the pedestal again, just for good measure, and then get out of here. So, we found a broken gem. It's not even in our inventory. Okay, so now we need to go back to... Uh, ruin. Let's stay at the end, for good measure. Yes, Luffy is set to leave it there. I was just kind of saying that that's not an item that we've taken with us. It is literally just a, um... A story flag. I'm looking for sapphires. Do you have any? Yes, I think uh, green or blue sapphires would suit you well. Sapphires are blue. Green is not a sapphire. Red is not a sapphire. Green and blue. Um, do you have any red sapphires? You mean rubies. No, not rubies. Red sapphire. Okay, I'm glad that they're actually pointing out that this is incorrect. Rubies and red sapphires are the same thing, you see. What? You're saying that rubies are red sapphires? That's right, rubies and, and sapphires are exactly the same. The red ones are rubies, the other colors are sapphires. Are there green sapphires? Rubies and sapphires are the same. Hmm, I didn't know that. So do you have any rubies or sapphires? Sorry, we, we used to have rubies from the mines of Madame. Nothing has come here recently. You don't have anything? Sorry, I can't help you. We do have some lovely emeralds and pearls. <laughs> well, emeralds and opals, but, uh, you know. But that gave us the information that we need. I should be able to close this guy now, I think. And by close, I mean minimize. Uh, so let us... Warp to Madame. Uh, I want to not target the same guy. It was an easy fight, but we still gotta properly target different things. I think this is the card game.
It's not. Okay, it's that cave up there, isn't it? What? Sapphires? Oh yes, we used to mine plenty in the old days. The old man at the end might still have them. Attack on everything else. Should be fine. Seven or eight years I've been mining rubies. My whole life has been spent on rubies. Listen, sir, we need rubies. Are you sure there are no more here? Why do you need rubies? We need them to meet someone called Artea. Artea? Ar the Artea of Doom Island? You know about him? Everyone of my generation knows about Artea, but why do you want to see him? The Sinistrals are about to return. We need his help to stop them. The Sinistrals? Wait, I'll give you the ruby I've been saving. Take this one, it's called the Hope Ruby. The Hope Ruby? Why? Why is it here? The kingdom of Meden depended on rubies. I thought that Meden would die without it, so I kept the real one here. Of course, a fake one was used after that. Perhaps there wasn't a reason to keep this one. The fake was destroyed. The, kingdom of, the king of Meden finally found out. I see. I'm glad to hear it. Well, this ruby isn't necessary. Here, you take it. Are you sure? If I could wish on the Hope Ruby, I'd ask that the Sinistrals never reappear. It's the best I've found in 70 years. I want you to have it. Well, thank you, sir. I'm also going to take the rest of your crap. Like this diamond ring and this emerald, and I have too many things, damn it. I'm going to be doing some more cleaning before the next session. There we I am glad, at the very least, that uh, you have a special inventory for uh, for key items. We can probably sell a couple of things here. Basically, I, I need to, uh, to clear up enough room to last me another 18 minutes. I'm not too worried about uh, selling too, too much right now. Okay. 
Um, so now we have the red gem, which we need to do last, I believe. And yes, I did just check the uh, the guide again for good measure. That does seem like uh, the only move that we can really do right now is the red tower and the boss therein. So I guess let's uh, and check my inventory. Long sword, light armor. Buckler, Bronze Helm, I choose and Blue Ring. Long Sword, Light Armor, Bronze, um, yeah, Buckler, Bronze Helm, especially in Daze Ring, which I don't know what that means. Uh, I should have the Flash Ring? Might be the bolt ring, actually. And then uh, Jared should have the green ring. And then Jared is going to take us back to Ruan. Time to try this again, because as far as I can tell, that's the only thing that we really can do right now. This is the wrong path. Enemies appear to be nice enough at least to leave me alone for the most part. As soon as I finish that sentence, there's a one. Guess I shouldn't have said that out loud. It's also really annoying that uh, an enemy hitting a party member who is confused does not unconfuse that party member. Agro levels up. You know what? It's a surprise attack anyway. I think if I want to, uh, you know what, I have enough of them. Okay. So how do I beat this guy? Suddenly, despite being called Dark Ghost, it is neither considered to be a ghost or flying, but rather undead, which you cannot exploit, so Lufia should just cast Flash every round. In the first round, the, the hero should cast Drain, Agro should attack, and Jaren should use a power guard. 
on Ahiro. In the second round, both guys should attack while Jiren uses the power guard on the hero. Jiren should focus on healing from there as needed, even though the, gar the Dark Ghost spells are not that threatening. Two power guards, first of all. There's a power drug. I guess. Uh, Agro can't do much but attack. Uh, and then. The hero should cast Drain. Uh, Lufia should be casting Flash every round. And we're going to use the power of Dragon Agro. Drugs, drugs, drugs. Which are good, which are bad. Drugs, drugs, drugs. Ask your mom or ask your dad. Um, and you should just keep attacking. You should just keep using flash. And from this point, Jaren is our healer. Dark Ghost spells are not that threat. This is pretty threatening, guide. Like that, that is. That is some pretty big damage. That was MP Drain, you monster. Well, I guess she's gonna be healing entirely by items. knows how to heal itself. There's um, no one that particularly needs to heal up right now. So I think I'm going to use a liqueur on Agra. There we go. Whew, that was rough actually. I level up.
I am the Water Fairy. Thanks for removing the Dark Ghost. Now we can restore the lake again. And the toxic marsh under this tower will also return to, this, to its original splendor. I really can't thank you enough. Look, a pedestal. It's pretty cool, huh? Hey! We live here like we always have. Let's immediately forget that there was ever a problem. will be restored. Now the lake has been restored. Have you not looked outside? When the red ruby shines, the road to Alfreya will open. So just everyone continuously saying, the red one is last. Like, yes, we have established the fact that the red one is last. We get it. Julia's so strong and handsome, too. Ooh. Don't say that around Lufia, she'll get jealous. Let's go back to the basement, see uh, how things look down there. Ooh, we got the blue jade. We got a dragon egg. And a miracle. If you ain't first, you're last. First place, uh, second place is first loser. Let's go to Genova. And the blue tower should be around here, yes. Make our way to the top of this tower. That should be, for the most part, pretty unobstructed. That seemed like an unnecessary bang, but, uh, you know. Nope, that's not it. We get ambushed by a bunch of slime. And also slimy amphibians. Come on, really? Yeah, I'm kind of in a position where, like, only Lufia can be the one who, uh... who knocks people out of Confuse because Jaren is going to attack the entire party and uh, Coolio and Agaro are just going to annihilate whichever party member they end up hitting. Especially if that party member is Lufia. <laughs>
gameplay. Lou feels confused. Time to take her down. No, Dad. I'm the one who's going to take her down. Julia, what do you say? There we go. Now we go south. Time to throw ourselves off this giant tower and can die. Unfortunately, this game has no fall damage. Alright, so now we get to the top of the green tower. And we put the green jade on top of there. And then I get Jaren to take us to the lawn. stay at the end for good measure, especially because it's cheap. Cheap is free, apparently. Because we restored the water, we just get to stay for free. And now we gotta get to the top of this tower. It's not there. I always get lost in the red tower. Surprise attack on these Lamias. Fat load of nothing on most of the way up here, and then we get to the top, and that's where all the enemies are. And we place the red sapphire, and I hear something. I don't hear it. I don't hear anything. Only I can hear it. The voice of the wind. The whisper of self. What do you hear, Jaren? A magical spell. Alfreya's spell. Is it possible? Away we go! I just get warped directly to Alfreya. Now we don't actually need to stay at the Is there a... No, apparently not. Uh, can we warp to Alfreya now that we've been here? No. Alright, we, we're gonna go a little bit over here. Because, uh... I can't save here. And I apparently can't warp back here. I'm probably not gonna go a whole lot over here. 
Ooh, that, uh, that trident seems pretty good, but also very expensive. For, uh, for money here, too, just so we can uh, get some of these upgrades. Well, first of all, I want this speed source that you've been hiding. And secondly, I want more room in my inventory. And I think I'm stacking speed on Coolio right now, so I'm going to keep doing that. Who are you people? Where do you think you are? This is... Vilka. It's alright. Let them pass. Fine. As you wish. You came about the Sinistrals, didn't you? How did you know that? Your energy told me. You're related to Maxim, are you not? My name is Coolio. I'm, the, I'm a descendant of Maxim. I see. I feel the same energy from you as Maxim. For a moment, I thought he was back. You, you're Artea? Yes, I am. Artea, the Sinistrals are about to return. I must have your help. I'm sorry, but I can be of no help to you. Why not? I lost my sight at the Battle of Doom Island. Besides, I'm old now. Oh no. I'm sorry that I can't help you. I can't help, but perhaps the Dual Blade can. Dual Blade? Isn't that the sword Maxim used at the Battle of Doom Island? Exactly. The sword that defeated the Sinistrals. His power comes from the owner's energy. But I don't have the dual blade. I don't even know where it is. It's probably at the bottom of the sea with Doom Island. In the sea? You must use the dual blade to defeat Daos, the chief Sinistral. Only one who has the same power as Maxim can wield the dual blade. But what can I do? The dual blade is at the bottom of the sea. Do you know Professor Rael, uh, Rael Shia? I think we've heard that name before. <laughs> Just exactly what Lufia says. He's a descendant of Lexa Shia, who helped Maxim and I a long time ago. He's a genius inventor. Professor Shia might know a way to travel over the sea. Odell is south of the small shrine and over the mountains. Shia's lab is in the basement of the castle. Alright, I'll go to Odell. Coolio, you must defeat the Sinistrals. We cannot re relive the nightmare of 99 years ago. I understand. I swear I'll stop them. I'll give you this key. You should be able to reach the small shrine from the cellar. The rest is up to you. Wait! You, elf child, I have something for you. Milka, give her that one. Okay. Here, take this. Jaren gets Artea's bow. This is my bow. You have elf blood in you. You'll know how to use it. Are you sure I can have this? How can I help Coolio if I keep it? Take it and help Coolio. I understand. Thank you. Ooh, that is a big upgrade. Look at that. All of a sudden he gives me the bow. The friggin' bow is cursed. Oh, 
Okay, well that takes us to here. Well, where is here? Most importantly, where can I find a, um, a rest stop? Or at least a town that I can warp to. As the Fro Gert is also cursed. The Fro Yo is fine, you see. RTL appears also, he also does in part two. He also does at the beginning of this game when we're recounting the story of like the whole battle thing. But yes, part two is uh, the prequel to part one. Dual blade? Ha! I shave with four blades. I'm Link, and also Link, and also Link, and also Link. See, now is the time that I want to make a joke that uh, J-Pop and Zero would totally understand, but none of you... None of you out there probably would, uh, get it. But I know that they're going to, uh, check out the VOD after this. So I'll say it anyway. Brett the Hitman Heart versus Brett the Hitman Heart versus Brett the Hitman Heart. Okay, that's not a town, though. Also, I walked into the swamp like a genius. It's okay if you don't understand what I'm talking about, Jewel. Okay, this is a warp zone. Part of the problem, though, is like if I take this warp zone, the south to the town of Odell, on the way to Odell, go to the village of Ranks, the place of healing. Also, I know that you just redeemed a thing, Jewel, but I'm going to be doing that after the stream because right now I'm focusing on ending the stream, which should have been over 10, ten minutes ago, but um, the game decided not to give me a way out. game. I, I understand that this is an RPG, but please give me somewhere that I can stop. Correct. Now I can't warp because I don't have a like I I would be losing I would be making negative progress if I warp. 
I need to find the next town that I can warp to. And the whole reason that I didn't warp out of uh, Elfrea is because it didn't give me the option to warp back to Elfrea. And now Agra is dead. Like, I went into Elfrea, then left, then brought up the warp menu, and Elfrea was not there. So... This is ranks. There is an in here. Please tell me that there is. Okay, there is. Good. Let's go to the inn. Okay. Just an apprentice, but you're doing your best. Well, as long as you can save our game, that is the important thing here. So, with that, we we have found our way to Elfreya, and unfortunately, Artea can't do a whole lot for us, except for you know giving um, giving Jaren a kick-ass bow, but. Um, we do have a, uh, a way forward. We gotta get to Odell Lake and do some fishing. But that is going to be for next time. Best well, prepare for the next adventure. I look forward to seeing you again soon. And I look forward to seeing you guys again next week. So thanks for coming out. Uh, thank you to Ganba, Jewel, Tyrion, Foose, and Mazzy um, for hanging out and chat. Shout out to J-Pop and Zero. Hope you enjoyed your hockey game. The next scheduled stream is going to be on Sunday at 8 p.m. or later Atlantic Daylight Time. It is the Sunday Super Shuffle back on its regular night. Uh, we're going to do some archipelago, archipelago shenanigans and as long as I don't do stupid things again with my hard drives, I should be able to participate whether or not I have to reboot into Windows. And that takes us round week round wheel for our next uh, long run stream next Tuesday at uh, 9 p.m. Atlantic Standard Time. We're going to continue our run through of Lufia and Fortress of Doom restored. I always like restored, revisited, reloaded, reignited, whatever the hell like there's so many different ways the different people have said exactly the same thing anyway we're going to Odell next week um of course if you want to uh, follow me on co-host you can do so co-host.org slash you can also uh support me with recurring payments on the bear pay or uh, one-time payments on buy me a coffee and the links are in chat right now that's gonna do it. Thank y'all for watching. I'm Corey if you don't know. I'll see you guys next time.